Hello my creepy pupples. Welcome to Creepy Corners. Um, so I really don't have a video plan for tonight. However, Chris from old OMG Chris, I think that's, I don't know, is that your channel name still? Anyway, he asked me about doing a cemetery visit and so I'll probably do that on Sunday for the Sunday video. So get ready for that. Um, but I did want to show you this. It's my, my bat wall. So this is the start of the bat wall, and then that's a mirror that my granny had. Um, but uh, mom had a really cool idea that I should do like a moon somewhere, and then also a spooky tree. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a, um, like a, out, a silhouette of a tree and put a light behind it and then cast the light here <laughs> so that I can, you know, um, outline it and then paint it all black and so it'll be spooky tree and then I'll have a uh, um, moon probably up there anyway um, unless you guys have any other ideas for that let me know I came down here to get my <laughs> my battery um, so here's my my chandelier yeah <laughs> I said candelabra last time um, anyway I'm just I've been working and I'm sure my neighbors are um, excited to see that I'm talking to my phone again. <laughs> and uh, anyway, so that's what I've been doing. I did hang up a couple of other things, like I really love her. I don't know if you can actually see her and Haunted House, of course. And then these are pieces of art that my husband made for me. And, um, and then I made this. I know you can't, I know you can't see it. It's too dark to see it. Sorry. But, um, but yeah. Um, I hope that if you're in the path of the hurricane that you're staying safe and, um, you know, evacuating or whatever you're supposed to do. Um, and that's a uh, scary cause I know, you know, it doesn't, I guess it, does it really seem like it could be that bad of a thing, but that all the flooding is really bad. And I also understand that it is Thanksgiving in Canada. So happy Thanksgiving to all my Canadian buddies. Um, or should I say my Canadian popals? Um, which actually I think a Canadian, yeah, a Canadian uh, came up with that name. So there you go, blazer. <laughs> um, What's going on with you? What are you doing for Halloween? It's coming up soon. I'm starting to freak out a little bit because I haven't done anything out in the front yard yet other than um, tie some rope light around the, the railing or whatever. Um, I did purchase a one of those lights that has, you know, movement or whatever. And the one that I got has its red circle with black spiders in the spider web. Um, but I'm going to have to go get an extension cord and probably a timer because I don't want to have to go out there and plug it and unplug it and plug it and unplug it every, every day. Um, and then my neighborhood, um, there's, there, some people have their house fully decorated. Um, maybe I'll show you guys some of that, um, later this, you know, for maybe next week. Um, and some people have at least started, some people have just pumpkins right now. And so it's kind of cool to see people. And it's so funny. I'm driving through going to work and I'm looking at people's houses and I see that they have their decorations up and I'm just driving and smiling. Like this is the time of year that I'm just so happy. It's so exciting to see everybody decorating for Halloween. And, um, I don't know. I just love it. I love seeing people get into the the thing that I do all year, I like seeing them do it once a year because it makes me happy. Anyway, I think that's going to be it. Um, sorry, I don't have too terribly much to tell you. I've been, like I said, I've just been working like crazy. My job just changed, so I've got a lot going on job-wise. And uh, my yard is a swamp, basically. I'll tell you more about that after, after October is over. Um, by then maybe it'll just be it'll be a, like an ice skating rink <laughs> and I'm laughing about it but I think it's probably gonna happen um so yeah 
tell me how you are. Tell me what's going on. If you're in one of the states that's affected by the flood, I mean, by the hurricane, let us know that you're okay. Um, and have a good day or good night wherever you are. And I will talk to you on Sunday. Bye.